Hey guys, what is up? And I welcome each and every one of you to a new, you know, relatively quick League of Legends video. Today I'll be showing you how to do this really cool kind of unlimited or global ZW trick or bug or whatever it's called. Let me just show you guys an idea as to what exactly it looks like first. Check it out. Watch. You hold someone like this, you walk, you know, really far away, somewhere obviously farther than your W range, and then you do that. Look at that. Isn't that weird? Isn't that cool? So big shout outs goes to someone named Ace Deathmark. He's the one that I'm assuming invented this trick. Uh, he, he showed it to me in my uh, public Discord. So I'm gonna link his video down below. So obviously big shout outs goes to him. But I'm gonna show you guys this trick and various things you can do with it. And uh, yeah, it's it's pretty damn cool, right? So check it out. So essentially what you wanna do is, you know, it's fairly simple to do, uh, the basic version of it. There's a more complicated one I'll show you later, which is really cool. But essentially you ult someone, right? Because actually refresh the cooldowns. You want to ult someone, and then as you ult them, you know, you can go however far you want. And then you want to W, and as the W is coming out, you press R and then W again, right? So the second you activate W to fly out, you instantly press R to go back. And the second you go back to your ultimate shadow, you instantly press W again. Pretty much all in the time that it takes for your W to actually uh, actually reach the you know initial destination. Check it out, watch. This time I'm not gonna actually go uh, back to Z. I'm not gonna hold the space bar. So we'll go over here. I'll go watch this. Check it out. Right? Watch this. Right? That's how fast you have to do it, right? So it's pretty damn cool, and you can do a lot of sweet things. Now, in case you're wondering, oh, is this actually global? Like, can I actually do this across the whole map? Well, let me show you guys. You all someone, let's just use the training tool to teleport us over here. Check it out. Right, obviously it is global, right? So you can pretty much use this all over the map. Now that's gonna be like essentially what the trick is, right? And you can do a lot of cool things. So for instance, let's say you're, you know, you're running away, like you're here, you know, you're chilling. You ult this guy here, you're running away, and you can be really distracting, right? You can go over this, you can go like that, like that, you know, and it could be very, very uh, distracting for the uh, enemy players that are trying to chase you. If I hold the space bar down, it doesn't look as cool, but watch, if I actually don't hold the space bar down and I go like this instead, it looks a bit cooler, right? Right, it's very, very confusing because you, you can be all in different areas. If you use it from a bush, it can also be somewhat confusing. Um, so if you like ult here, for instance, you know you're running all the way up here. You can actually just throw the W in here, and you can go like this, right? And you're going into like two different bushes, and it can be very confusing as to where the hell did he just go or what the hell did he just do. Uh, so it's pretty cool in that sense. Now, like I said, there is going to be a more um, I guess complicated version of this trick and that's to hide your W with your Q. This works the best in Championship Z because watch, I'll just put this on for now so you guys can see it. If you use the Q and W the same in the same area, it's it kind of hides it, right? Check it out, watch. Right? It's very hard to see the actual shadow come out, right? Because the Q essentially covers up the whole kind of travel on the ground of the W. If you combine that with this trick, it's uh, it's very hard to do, especially in the heat of a moment, you know, like in an actual game. It's honestly very, very difficult to do, and it will take a lot of practice, but you can make it even more confusing. As the people are, are going to be like, where the hell did this W come from? How the hell did he even get there? Because I didn't see his W even come out at all. Alright, so check it out, boys. Check it out. This is how you do it. Watch. You ult someone, you walk down, Q, W, Alt, W. Q, W, Alt, W. Right? It's very hard to do, but essentially it's the exact same trick, uh, but this time you ult someone, you walk down, you Q, and then W right after. The second you activate W, you press R, and the second you press R, you pretty much just press W, right? But what if I don't actually hold the space bar? It looks much cooler. Check it out. This is how it looks like. Very, very cool stuff. Ult. Walk down. Right? Right? You don't really see the shadow. You don't see the shadow come out. It's very, very hard to see. Watch. You can do the other way too. Check it out. You can do from, you know, looking upwards, I guess, instead. Right? Go all the way up here. Let's say the opponent's over there or something, you know. Q, W, R, W. Right? It's pretty hard to see, right? The Q, it looks like the Q and only the Q is flying there, but instead you have a whole bunch of other things. So there's a whole lot of stuff you can do with this trick. Fairly, you know, quick video. I want to show you guys this, uh, you know, really neat, I guess, trick or bug or whatever you want to call it. I think it's fantastic. I honestly was really, like, Kind of amazed almost, if you will, when the first time I saw this on Ace's video. So I will link his video down below, guys. Show him some love as well. Go to his video, maybe comment, like, subscribe to his channel, whatever you want to do. Do what you got to do. But uh, yeah, big kudos to him. Cool trick. Check it out. Try it in your own games as well. There's a lot of stuff you could do with this. And uh, I think it's just honestly very, very awesome. I had no idea you can do it. I had no idea you can actually make it global, which I think is the coolest part, right? The fact that you can actually essentially be a global. Check it out. Like, we'll, we'll do one more time just for the sake of this video, right? Teleport down here. W, R, W, oh, yeah, it's pretty cool, pretty damn cool. But either way, guys, let me know what you think about this trick down below. If you enjoyed the video, hit it with that like button. This is definitely a video that I, you know, hopefully ask you guys to share with your friends, to let people see this, let people know exactly what you can do on Z now, because I've never seen anyone do this before. And uh, yeah, I think uh, I'll see you guys for the next video. Thank you for watching. Subscribe if you haven't. All that good stuff. Peace.